What's going on you guys? It's your boy Chopper. Welcome back to another video. Um boys, today we're actually back on Spawn PK. We're not doing we're not doing anything else. We're just going to have a nice little sit down video cuz you know, I, I feel like these are kind of important in a way. Like me spamming content on my channel isn't is it, it's important cuz you know, it keeps me active and stuff like that on my YouTube channel. But I kind of feel like stuff like this actually gives me a chance to connect with you guys, especially guys, especially a lot of you guys are being in the comments and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get some backlash of this video, but I honestly have my own concerns about Spawn PK. But don't take this video as me going on ahead and quitting Spawn PK. I will not be quitting fucking Spawn PK. I love this damn server. I play this shit every fucking day, or at least the, the amount of time that I can play. I'll try to play Spawn PK or try to make a video out of it. But <clears throat> I do want to go ahead and uh, make a little quick little side note of this as well. I do want to go ahead and tell you guys I really, really appreciate all of you guys that's actually been watching the channel. Yo, the YouTube channel has been doing excellent. Like, oh my God, bro. You guys don't even understand. Like, I really fucking appreciate every Like, even even my non-star PK videos have been getting a lot of views. And I really appreciate, like, all of you guys literally watching it. Like, all of you. Like, you guys don't understand, but you guys are really, like, helping your boy chop out. Because, like, I'm not a lot, but You know, I make videos all fucking day long, all day long. But I don't really get to make, uh, you know, sit-down videos. Because I kind of feel like those, well, these are not really as enjoyable as I would like them to be. But, you know, I just want to go ahead and tell you guys I really, really appreciate it. And I will be going ahead and doing a $200 giveaway on this video. Just to tell you guys that I appreciate all of the, all. I appreciate everything that you guys have been doing, honestly. Like, even with the non spawn PK videos, I really appreciate it. Like, you guys don't understand. Like, it actually means a lot to me. I really do appreciate it. So, I'll, just go, I'll be going on a giveaway $200 on today's video. Also, boys, the giveaway winners from last video will be in the description down below. I do want to go ahead and uh, let that know, too, because a, a, a lot of people still ask me that same question, even though I put it in a video. But it'll be in the description down below. But some of my concerns about Spawn PK is really just new players and like how Spawn PK is doing it. You know the background of Spawn PK that a lot of you guys really don't get to see. And as you guys know, I'm I'm literally with a lot of the staff team all the fucking time. Like bro, even in I'll be in Tevin's fucking live streams in his damn stream, just be talking a lot of bullshit to Tevin and shit like that. You know, us just really enjoying each other and stuff like that. And we actually talk off stream. Well, we talk off stream and everything. And, you know, I do have my own input on Spawn PK because I do play it a lot, and I think that my input does have some type of some type of account to it i kind of just feel like spawn pk needs a, a revamp and i i don't know why but i, I just kind of not erasing everybody's bank but like like ryan taking the time out of his day to actually just you know revamp his game you know what i'm saying like a lot of the stuff on spawn pk is hella old like little do y'all know the shops haven't been revamped in years like those been the same shops and before when I first, 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 first started actually paying Spawn PK again and making videos. Like, the shops have been the complete same. Nothing has really changed towards them. Like, literally nothing. And I kind of feel like those are something that's really, really important. He should try to take out a lot of the old shit that's inside the game as well. Uh, a lot of the mystery chests and uh, epic pet mystery boxes. Well, no, no, no. The epic pet mystery boxes are actually fine. But... A lot of the mystery chesses and stuff like that are really old. Like, you can't get none of the new shit that actually been added into Spawn PK. You can't get none of that shit. You only get, like, a lot of the old stuff. And I just kind of feel like those need to be revamped. Like, a lot of stuff in Spawn PK really needs to change. Because I kind of feel like, in, in a way, Spawn PK is really dying in a way. And a lot of you guys are probably like, yo, Chopper, what the fuck are you talking about? Yo, bro, Spawn PK is hype right now. Actually, it's really fucking not. Like, little do y'all know. The PVM side of Spawn PK, because that's really what I promote on my channel, is like a lot of PVM content. I, I, PK, I PK here and there, but I mostly PVM content. PVM, I would say PVM side of Spawn PK, bro, you were popping. I'm not gonna lie to you, like, we're OD, but from what I remember back in the day when Spawn PK was lit, bro, we had so many PKers. Like, y'all don't understand. PKers play a big role in Spawn PK as well as the PVMers do, right? So I can't be biased by any type of chance as well. I kind of feel like both of these actually play their own role. Like, honestly, like, if you guys really just sit down and think about it, being PK in Spawn PK, it might be annoying at first at that little moment, but it actually makes you better as a PVMer as well. You learn how to tank. You learn how to do a lot of other stuff. And and to be honest, Spawn PK has been really like laid back, and I really don't. I really don't think that that's how it should be. I think it should be like a lot. I think it should. It should be a lot going on in Spawn PK. You know what I'm saying? Uh. 
PVM wise, Bobby K is good. PKing wise, Bobby K is dying in PKing wise. There's no deep wild DP gayers anymore. There's no teams. They're like, I, and I'm pretty sure everybody has their own speculations on what the hell's going on, but I'm just going off of what I see and like what I've been seeing on Spawn PK. And I know a lot of people probably are like, yo, like, this is actually stupid, Chopper. You're being a fucking retard. But let's keep it real. Back in the day, Spawn PK was lit with PKers. There was like, there was like hella teams. There are PBM teams. But it's like the only team that I know that is still actually alive is the one with fucking Salty. And I forgot, I forgot the name. And I, I was actually in that team a long ass time ago. There's no PKing teams anymore. There's literally one. There's this. There's a uh, fucking lockdown. And there, there's like there's a couple other ones, but they're really small. You know what I'm saying? Like there's, it's no it's no PK it's no PKing fun anymore. You know what I'm saying? PKing wise, the small PK is dying, and Ryan needs to honestly do something about it. I kind of feel like he needs to go ahead and just like I understand that Ryan's trying to grow. I guess he's trying to go Runex or whatever, and I, that's fine as well. But Honestly, Ryan, you should really take some time out of your day to actually go ahead and look at Spawn PK, cause like, but we all love this fucking game. Like, we we can all we can all agree that Spawn PK is the most cracked out fucking game in the world. And don't think I'm saying cracked out as in this is it's hella bad. It's actually fucking fun as hell, and it's really addictive. That's what I'm saying about Spawn PK. Spawn PK is hella addictive. Like, we can all sit there and say, oh, we'll gamble our banks and literally quit. We'll, we'll tell our friends, yo, we quit, bro. I'm not coming back. Bro, two weeks later or a week later, we're all back. Let's keep it real. This is how, this is how Spawn PK works. But that's actually another thing that I do want to go ahead and touch on. Rebuilding on fucking Spawn PK is fucking ass. Like, oh my god. Like, you have to have, like, really good gear. You Or you have to, matter of fact, let's, let, let's, keep, let's keep it like this. On Spawn PK, rebuilding is shit. If you are not... A person that has some really good skill base on Spawn PK, as in PKing wise, like you guys are not a PK, but you're gonna have a hard time on Spawn PK because you on Spawn PK you need money to make money. Like you, you honestly need money. That's why when I actually started my road to I think Ten Trail, I didn't even I didn't even clean myself because it was just like I'm not gonna go through that hassle of me having to sit there and gamble my whole fucking bank again and do all the extra shit again. I'm just gonna go ahead and take out the extra shit that I really don't even give a fuck about and play. Cause a rebuilding on Spawn BK is really trash and that is something that should be going on ahead to be fixed. Honestly, like he should add some type of daily that makes you guys at least, uh, honestly, I honestly feel like people should be making at least 100 bill a day off dailies. And that's just my opinion. I kind of feel like 100 bill is something good. Like that 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 is actually a good ass a good ass deal. Especially for the average player, like a, a new player that have that has no type of like idea of what the fuck is going on on Spawn PK. But it, it's, it's we should at least be making like at least fifty to a hundred bill off dailies by itself. And that should that that's honestly feel like that's actually really, really good because that brings more players and then if that brings more players, that brings down the eco as well. A lot of stuff will be uh used more, a lot of stuff wouldn't be so low in price, a lot of stuff wouldn't be uh so high in price as well as that. Now I love the body guys probably like, yo, but that, that that has nothing to do with uh Spawn PK. That's really just the eco holder. Yeah, that, that's true too, but at the same time, we bring in more players, we can actually have a lot more things to do when it comes on Spawn PK, because then there'll be more teams, and there'll be a lot more stuff. But I honestly just feel like Ryan taking the time out of his day to actually revamp Spawn PK and make Spawn PK how it used to be, boy, it's like, we would be fucking lit. Like, but y'all don't understand, like, Spawn PK is the game that I fucking love playing. Like, I, I literally, I literally been cleaned. Gamble my bank away, cleaned again, gamble my bank away, got rich, rich again, rich again, got rich, rich again, got rich again, bro. Like, it makes no sense how much I've played Spawn PK and literally lost everything and enjoyed losing it. Like, being rich in Spawn PK is cool for me, but it's, 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 as, it's really boring for me as well. Because it's like after you get rich, there's no, there's no end goal with Spawn PK. It's just honestly get money, PK, PVM. That's all you do. That's literally the aspect of Spawn PK. Is get money, PVM, PK, gamble, and that's it. And that's and I, I know a lot of you guys are probably like, "Yo, Chopper, that's really just in-game content." But it's not. Like it's it's, it's literally not in-game content at all. There's no aspect of Spawn PK. It's basically you guys just playing it, honestly. And I kind of feel like we should have some type of quests on Spawn PK. You know, something to keep the players going. You know what I'm saying? Like even if they rich as hell. It's still gotta do these to progress in the game, and that even that, that even adds a nice little eco to it as well. I don't know, you guys are probably like, yo, but it's spawn PK, it's a key gang server. But damn, bro, like 
even though it's a PKing server, you don't think that Spawn BK at least deserves more content on it? Because, like, I'm pretty sure all, we all can agree that Spawn BK do need some new content on this motherfucker. We all need new content. Spawn PK needs a whole thing of new content. We need new stuff. Like, come... I was like, we need to make Spawn BK honestly lit again. Now, I'm not pretty sure that Ryan might see this, but I honestly think that if he does see this, Ryan, honestly, bro, it's like, bro, like, honestly, look at Spawn PK for what it's doing right now. Like, even though, like, you haven't really did, like, the biggest updates in the world, Spawn PK is still popping. Like, you have more than enough time to actually go ahead and change Spawn PK and bring a lot of players back. Now, I know a lot of you guys do hit me up about, oh, my account is banned and this and that. Bro, I'm not even staff. Like, I don't even know why y'all even hit me up with that. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, I'm not gonna talk to staff about what staff team works. Like, I cannot do that. I have no type of intake on on reports of you or you banning. Like, I can't, I'm not staff. I'm literally just a YouTuber who just loves Bomb PK. Let's just keep that real. Like, that's just me. I know you guys probably think that I'm rude because I always say that to you guys, but it's literally true. Like, I'm not a staff, and I can't tell you guys anything that a staff would do on Spawn PK. Like, I can't. That's literally, like, overstepping my boundaries and also a staff boundaries as well. And plus, I can get banned for that shit because that's impersonating a staff too. So I can't, I can't honestly make it seem like I'm staff or I, I know what's going on all the time like i really don't i honestly don't even know what goes on in back of the back background of staff work so for all the guys that always pm me about staff work yo it is not me i am not fucking staff you cannot pm me about that i'm literally a youtuber who just enjoy the game and i honestly feel like a lot of things about spawn pk should be fixed considering the fact that pvming should be fixed more i kind of feel me personally bro 220 drop rate come on bro the drop, my drop rate is hella ass. I'm not gonna lie, like, I kind of feel like drop rate is broken, too, in a sense. Like, I don't know, I don't know why, but I kind of feel like I get this weird ass, like, you shouldn't be sitting at a fucking, you shouldn't be sitting at a boss for fucking three, four hours with 220 drop rate and barely getting nothing. Like, I legit, I, that's, why I've been, that's why I've been doing a lot of 10-hour things, just to show you guys the loot. And I would go dry for about 10, but I'm not, not even 10, probably like about four to probably like three hours worth of PDM. I would go hella fucking dry and I wouldn't get anything. And I kind of feel like that shit is broken. Like it should not be like that, honestly. And with the PKing, the only thing that I would say is active about PKing is Edge. Edge. Deep Wildy ain't PK. Deep Wildy is not. We need more Deep Wildy fucking P PKers, boys. Like, we really do. We need more clans. We, need, we honestly just need more players. We need more people to really just come out and enjoy the game. Now, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have your own speculations on what needs to be changed. I actually want to hear those in the comments down below. Because I don't know, boys. Ryan just might watch this motherfucker. Like, you just don't understand. Like, me reaching out to Ryan, I can't. I've never, ever had a conversation with Ryan. Ever. I've never. I, bro, I can't even PM Ryan. And that's crazy because I've been playing Spawn PK for about two years now on video. Two years on video, right? And I've been playing Spawn PK about two years on video. I have yet to talk to Ryan about any type of content, nothing. Like, I can't, I can't not get in touch with that. So I'm making this video to go ahead and let Ryan know, like, honestly, Ryan, Runex is cool and all, but bro, take your time out your day to actually look at the main server that is popping. I honestly think that Spawn PK is a really good server and it, and it bro, it could be. Spot PK could really be big as fuck, big as how, it could be really bigger than what it used to be, and Spot PK was big as hell, we was pushing like 500 something players, like four or 500 something players back in the day, from when I, from what I remember, and that was when Spot PK was really enjoyable, it was PVMing, it was PKers, but it used to be clan wars, like, it was just a lot of stuff that made me love Spawn PK, even though I used to die from P PKers, Bro, that shit, it molds you into a better player, honestly. Like, P P getting PK from other players honestly molds you guys to, to be a better PVMer. Because as you guys know, you got to deal with a lot of shit when it comes down to PVMing as well. So you got you to deal with PK, you got to deal with the boss trying to kill you, you got to deal with people trying to fall in on you, you got to deal with people trying to fucking smite you. Like, it's a lot of stuff that you guys got to deal with when it comes down to uh, P uh, PVMing. But... It makes you a better player just seeing just seeing PKers and PKers kill you. Like it really does. And I kind of feel like Spawn PK was missing that nice little aspect as well. Uh, I kind of I kind of feel like it does. So honestly, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about Spawn PK and like the road that Spawn PK is honestly taking. Do you guys think that Spawn PK will die off, or do you guys think that Orion actually pick up his shit and actually become actually just pick up his shit and just revamp his fucking game and make Spawn PK great again? Honestly. What do you guys think? Like, this is not even me slandering Spawn McCabe because I really love this fucking game. 
I just honestly feel like Ryan should really take the time out of his day to just go ahead and fix a lot of the stuff. Like, there's even bugs that I've seen. I've, I've, there's even bugs I've seen P, uh, PKers have, and it needs to be fixed. Like, Ron, uh, Tevin does his fucking absolute best to fucking bring content to you guys. Like, y'all don't understand, bro. I talked to Tevin off fucking video, off, like, I talked to Tevin for real, for real. Like, Te Tevin's my boy. Like, he goes through a lot, my boy. Like, just, just, co just coming on and dealing with, like, over 200 players every fucking day. Like, y'all niggas, y'all niggas don't understand. Like, that shit is a lot for a person as well. And just, just how Ryan and Tevin can do, can do it all day long is crazy. But I just feel like it, it's kind of my job, too, in a way. Because Tevin can't, he can't be the only one that honestly feels the way I feel, honestly. You know what I'm saying? Like, I kind of feel like, kind of feel like, bro, there should be a more, there should be more stuff going on at Spawn PK to keep players active to want to play. But that's honestly just my opinion on it. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Your boy Chop is out.